my name is Suba Gurwal and I'm a math expert. And today we're going to go over how to explain math patterning skills to preschoolers. So the first thing that we're going to want to do is help them recognize a pattern. Now a pattern, as you know, is anything that's kind of repeating. And the simplest patterns only involve two things. Like red, then blue, then red, then blue, then red, then blue. Just has to be two things. So we're going to start with recognition of simple patterns. And this can be in everyday things, like in the stripes on a bumblebee when they're walking with you through the grocery store. Just try and point out different patterns to help them recognize and start learning what that means, or jewelry, clothing, they're literally everywhere. And the second thing, once they've kind of got the hang of recognizing and identifying patterns, to create new ones, and extend old ones. So kind of putting what they learned into practice. So say uh, you're working with building blocks, like a fun toy or Legos, kids love Legos, and you had a big piece or a little piece and then a big piece. And then you would ask them to keep extending that pattern. Or what they could do with jewelry or colored cereal or even with physical activities like jumping then running then jumping then running just kind of trying to help them take what they learned in recognition and apply it to their everyday world uh, that's a great way to try and explain patterning to preschool kids and my name is Suva Gerwal thank you for taking an interest in math